Well, what's good, beautiful? Welcome back to the channel. It's me here, Ari. If you're new here, welcome. So you guys, today we are going to be doing eight layering combos that simply are fire. Now, as you guys know, I live down south, so there's still some hot days, but it's getting cooler. I've been able to like, you know, experiment with some new cooler things. I'm so excited because right now I smell so good. I'm going to wait to the last one to tell you what it is, but it's fire, so get ready. So I'm at the last part of the day, and it looks like it's about to rain, trying to pull in this natural light, because natural lighting is always better than, you know, the artificial lighting. So sometimes I make and sometimes I don't. That's why y'all see me filming in the dark a whole lot. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start with Saturday. So for Saturday's combo, I started with the Midnight Amber Glow. The reason I wanted to use this body wash was to bring out the bourbon vanilla. It has vanilla bourbon in it, okay? The reason why I wanted to do that is because I wanted to use my cozy vanilla bourbon. Y'all, this smells so good. I was just, I just made a video yesterday and I was talking about how liquor is taking over <laughs> for the fall and winter. Liquor is taking over these fragrances and it's so, oh, so good, okay? So the notes in this is warm bourbon, dark fruit, and vanilla liqueur. And it smells so good, y'all. I absolutely love this. So I pick up all that. I pick up the dark fruit, the warm bourbon, the vanilla. It is oh, so good. But I decided to layer with this, you guys. It may be weird. Was finery not another cherry? It's like cherry, the dark fruit, the bourbon, the vanilla. Oh my goodness. Y'all have got to try this combo. It's so, so good. I'm just smelling my little reminder. <sighs> got so many compliments. It is luscious. If you like bourbon and vanilla, mix that thing with a little cherry. And thank me later. So moving right along to Sunday, I just started to start with the Fiji Sunshine Body Wash. Fiji Sunshine is a beautiful, it's a beautiful guava and orange, luscious, delicious, wet scent. Okay, it smells so good. This is one of my favorite scents from Bath and Body Works for the summer, and that's Fiji Sunshine. So, the reason I decided to use that is I wanted to use my fairy tale. So, I'm just so excited to be able to pull out some of my fall scents, you guys. Because with it getting a little cooler, I feel comfortable just wearing a little heavier scent. So, the fairy tale has pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber so beautiful most of you guys know all about this so as I mentioned I put the lotion all over my body now the next thing I do I wanted to go in with Yara why Yara I don't know but it's good <laughs> so I went in with Yara you guys know this is such a sweet luscious strawberry airy fresh fruity Beautiful, beautiful scent. Love this, love this. So I sprayed the perfume all over my pulse points, and then I add the fairy tale beside my pulse points, and it wears so beautifully. You guys, it is, I love fairy tale. It is so pretty. And when you pair it with Yara, it does change it a bit, but it is beautiful. You have to try it. I absolutely love that. It's so pretty. It pairs well together. Okay, so next up, this is Monday's combo. So for Monday, I started with my Neutrogena, and this is the pear and green tea scent. And y'all can see this is almost gone. And y'all, Neutrogena has really, they've gone up on their prices. So I don't know if I'm going to be repurchasing this, although I do love it. It's perfect for the summer, spring. You can wear it anytime, really, but... The prices have really gone up, so I don't know if I'll be repurchasing this or not. Anyway, I started with the pair, and I decided to uh, go in with Chasing Fireflies. And you guys know this has Golden Pear, Jasmine Blooms, Illuminated Woods, okay? So, this, this is lovely. I wanted to bring out the pear, and I wanted to also make it sweeter. So, this is what I did. I lotioned down with the full lotion. Okay, so I also went in with my Pear Blossoms and by Mix Bar. So this gives a pear scent, but it's not sweet. 
it's not sweet you guys know i love sweet but it smells really good it just brought out the pear more i already had the pear body wash i'm, I'm adding a little pear uh perfume okay and then beside that i went in with Mont Blanc signature and i chose this vanilla because it has clementine and it's super bright and it wouldn't distract or take away. Sometimes if I use Vanilla 28, it's too heavy for a combo. Or they'll change it. I've noticed that's so one thing about Vanilla 28. It will make it sweeter, but it's going to also change your fragrance if you're not careful. If the other scent isn't strong enough. So this is a bright, light, airy scent that just complements that citrus. It just complements it, okay? Because it has clementine in it as well. So I went in with that and sprayed all that on my post points. And then I went in with my Chasing Fireflies Body Mist. And I just applied that right beside my pulse points because sometimes when you are working with other people and they're sensitive to perfumes, you can't just spray like you want to. And with my job where I'm sweating, when I sweat, my skin exudes that perfume, right? So I have to be very careful about how much I put on. If you're in a different situation, go for it. Go for it. So next up was Tuesday. I did not have the body wash that goes with this combination. So when I don't have that, I'll just use my Glow Getter. I'll use a bar soap and then I'll use my Glow Getter oil based uh, body wash to start out with, okay? So that is what I used. And next up, I decided to go in with my Fall and Bloom Lotion. And this has Juicy Plum, Wild Blooms, and Velvet Moss. So this gives off a very, very juicy plum, a overripe plum at the beginning. It's not a sour plum, it's very sweet. Um, and then it also has the bloom. So it's like sweet flowers. It's not very bitter, not too floral, but it's floral. It gives some floral, but it gives that sweet plum with the floral. And then um, the velvet moss almost gives like a woody scent as well, okay? So I went in with that lotion and I've been seeing everybody say that this is a dupe. This mist is a dupe for Burberry Her or Burberry Her Elixir, but I like the sweeter one, so I chose to use the Elixir on top of that. So I used the Elixir, and then I also used the Fall in Bloom Body Mist. Now, that still was not sweet enough for me for the day, so I just went in with just a little bit, just a little bit of Kaili, and this is vanilla number 28, just to give me that little sweetness, just a tad bit, because too much, like I said, will overpower your combo. You have to be very careful with this, very careful with her. But yes, I also have the Burberry Her perfume, but I just chose the elixir for that day, but you could, either, you could use either one. Okay, so next up for Wednesday's combo, I started out with my whipped coconut milkshake, and you guys know this gives that sweet vanilla ice cream note when it dries down. It has token coconut as well as amber vanilla ice cream, okay? So I started with the body wash, and then of course I went in with the body cream, okay? But now the perfume that I use is going to throw you off, but it's okay. Hang with me. Dolce, Dolce & Gabbana's Light Blue Summer Vibes. Y'all, I don't know why I just put these together, but when I tell you this is fire, if you have this, you gotta test it out. So this is the Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue Summer Vibes. And I went in with the coconut, whipped coconut milkshake. Y'all, that thing smells so good. So many compliments. So many compliments. And I'm going to tell you, the two together, the coconut, the vanilla ice cream, I don't know, the pineapple, it's just like a Sunday maybe. This is giving a Sunday. It's, it's so, so good. Luscious. If you guys have that, try that combination. You got to let me know what you think. I love it. So many compliments. Other people loved it too. So on to Thursday. Thursday was a good day too. All of these days were good, y'all. I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with any of these. Just try them out. Okay, so I went in with the glow glitter again because I kind of pieced this one together. I did not have the lotion. I did not have the body wash. I only have the body mist. Because some of these, if I feel like I want them, I'll go on Amazon and order it if it's no longer offered by Bath & Body Works because I just want to try it. I want to have it. 
um, in my collection. So this is one of those. So I went in with the Glow Getter and because of, of that and me not having a lotion or a body cream that would go with this and it's definitely a perfume vibe. It's not like gourmand or anything I can layer like vanilla with. I decided to go with my Ferragamo and this is Salvatore Ferragamo lotion. It's just a neutral almond scented lotion but it's amazing. It smells so good. It gives you a little almond scent, but it's just fresh and clean. Absolutely love this. Worth every penny. I think I got it at um, TJ Maxx and Marshalls. One of the two. Okay. And this is absolutely becoming one of my favorite perfumes. And this is Bacar. And this is the Roll Gold Edition. Whew. Girl, if you don't have this, you got to try it. Okay. It's up there with a top of yard for me. It's up there with Latafa Yara, and now I got some other ones I'm adding to it, but Latafa is killing the game, okay? This is so good. This is a uh, Bacar, Rose Gold Edition, and I went in with Life of the Party. I have been wanting this mist, so I went ahead and ordered it online, and I mean, sometimes you can get them pretty cheap. I got mine. This was like the last one for $14 something. I would have bought it, paid more for it at Bath & Body Works without having a coupon or whatever, but... Yeah, Life of the Party. Now, you know what? I cannot say this is one of my favorites, but it's definitely giving perfume. It's definitely giving perfume. It has pink citrus, bubbly prosecco, jasmine, and shimmering vanilla. So it does have some vanilla in there. But when I paired it with my rose gold, y'all, that thing is thanging. That thing is thanging. Do you hear me? Oh. It smells so, so good. I love making combos because if it's something that's just not your vibe, although it's not bad, it's just not your vibe, you can make it your vibe. You can add what you like to it. And sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't now, so you have to play around. But this works for me and it is beautiful. So if you happen to have this and it's not your favorite, try layering something that's sweeter and airier and juicier with it and it is a hit lovely okay so i don't think y'all ready for this one but this is friday's combo and that's why i got on again today because the thing is fire okay so i had to start out with the tree hug this is the limited edition and this is a cinnamon cinnamon dulce you guys oh my goodness talk about cinnamon goodness Oh, and it's so soft. It's so sweet. It, said, it, it smells like a cinnamon roll to me. It has ginger, sugar cane, shea butter. Y'all, you got to run and get this because this thing is fire, okay? I also saw the um, body scrub, but I just got a vanilla body scrub, and I'm not going to use all of that. So I decided to just get the body wash because I will use this more, okay? So I got that. Went in with that. Pumpkin pecan waffles. Y'all, ooh, Lord have mercy. I tell you the sweetness. The sweetness, baby. The sweetness. Okay, so this one has maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. Y'all, when I tell you, it is so good. And I could not get the big body mist of this. I only have the small one, so I will be savoring this, okay? I will not be using it all the time, but I was able to grab the small one. I don't know how I miss getting a big one, y'all. I'm so upset about that, but I do have the small one. So, I layered that with camera. Do y'all know about this? Do you know about this? I just made a video about this perfume. We got to get into the notes on this. Hold on. This is so good. When I tell you, and look at the bottle. Look how big the bottle is. And I think I may have spent $49 on this. It wasn't bad. But when I tell you, it smells expensive. People are liking this perfume to Killian's Angel Share. And I've heard how beautiful that is. I've never smelt it. But according to review, some people say it is so similar, but this one is a little bit different. So let me give you the notes. It's cinnamon, nutmeg, bergamot, dates, praline, tuberose, and it has vanilla, tonka bean, benzoin, amberwood, myrrh, and acagalia wood. But when I tell you this is so pretty, it is 
so beautiful. I am I am in love with this, okay? This is so good. And when I topped it with all of this other cinnamon, pumpkin, pecan, baby, oh, it smells so good. It smells like a dream. You guys, it's so pretty. So, so pretty. Now, this one, I didn't wear to work. I wore this to bed, okay? That was my bedtime. But, baby, it was good. For my little extra combo, I have one. It's not body mist on body mist today, but I like to wear this like anytime I have to run out and just smell fresh real quick. Just throw on something real quick and easy and you're going to smell fire, okay, shopping. So I use at the beach and I cannot find my lotion, but this is my small bottle. I have a bigger one. I don't know where my lotion is, you guys. I got to find it. I got stuff everywhere because I'm reorganizing my film room and my perfume and all of that. I'll show you guys what I'm doing later. But, yeah, so this is what I layer it with. And this is a hit right here, okay? And this is why it's El Libre and at the beach. You've got to try that combo if you have not tried it, okay? It is so good. Actually giving you guys a little bit more over eight but this is a perfume combo that I wore earlier today. Um, and that is going to start with, okay, yeah. I'll start with the Midnight Amber Glow again because of the bourbon vanilla. It just gives me that sweet vanilla vibe. And then I decided to layer my whole body with this Sweet Cream by Tree Hut. It smells so good. It's just a sweet, sweet base. Oh, y'all absolutely love that, okay? Later with the Tree Hut, and then I decided to use Perfume of Choice, and this is Caramel Dreams by Sabrina Carpenter, Sweet Tooth, and y'all know all about this, okay? I made a video about it. I'll leave a link down below in case you want to watch that, okay? Now, I decided to go in with Coconut Cream Pie. Oh, y'all. This is another one that I ordered from Amazon because I had to have it, okay? And it's Toasted Coconut Flakes, Caramel Custard, and Golden Pie Crust. So good, okay? To make it even more luxurious, I went in with Brazilian Crush Chirosa number 62. Girl, what you talking about? Okay, this has pistachio and salted caramel. Yeah, that combo is fire too. All of these combos is killing the game. You got to try them out, okay? You got, look at them. They even look alike. They even look alike. <laughs> they look alike, you guys. I'm telling you, these, these combos are all fire. I've been having so much fun doing these, making these videos. Um, I'm busy. I have a full-time job, a full-time manual job, labor job, you guys. I work hard, okay? And then I come and try to make these videos. And when you guys show me support, when you give me comments, it makes my day. When you say you love my videos and my channel, that makes my day. It makes it feel like it's worth all the effort I put into it, you know, because I film late at night, early in the morning, rushing filming hair. I'm filming it with y'all with wet, wet hair right now. I'm filming with wet hair because it's the only way I can get it done before the sun goes down, you know, but it is what it is and y'all accept me anyway. And I love you guys for that. I appreciate all of your support, your likes, comments, shares. <sighs> makes my day i hope i can make your day as well i hope you enjoyed the video and hopefully please make sure you subscribe if you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe what are you waiting for girl and hopefully i'll see you in the next video take care